Yes, yeah, so um, I'm going to be doing the patches of this one now, and I'll be using the wax gum. Look at the patches. I'm turning the blue garment into a well designed um, caftan. See, I've already gummed the, I put the gum stay behind the cloth already. So the gum is ejecting, is ejecting from the gun. Take a look at it. It's ejecting from the gun already. It's ejecting from the, you can see it's already gluing. It glues fast and it gets dried fast. So you have to do a very, very fast job. If you look at the gun very well, it's not coming out again. That's because it's been exhausted. So what I need to do is to plug in another wax from this end. So I plug in the wax and I continue. So that's it. I'll do that for all of the old, the, all of the patches round till I achieve a properly, a neat, a neat work. Okay, as you can see, I've done this side already. It's not, it can't open again. So I have to do all of this as well and do the same thing for all of the patches around the garment to change it completely. So I'll concentrate on the edges like the other styles as well. So I'm going to be putting the wax around it. Round it. Like I said, it gets cold easily, so I have to be very, very fast. Very, very fast. I trust I trust this much more than the Who Gum, the B6000 and all that. Because when you're ironing this, even if the wax gets cold while you're doing your work, once you put your iron on it, it melts again, which guarantees you a continuous gumming. I don't know if you understand what I'm trying to say. It guarantees you a continuous gumming, unlike the whole gum. Once it's expired, the thing can open. But this one, for each ironing, you keep, it's like you're renewing the work you've done. All right. So let's enjoy it. 